Jeffrey Rigathi Gachagua was born on February 28, 1965 at Heriga village of Mathira constituency in Nari County. His father is known as Nahashan Gachagua Rariani and his mother is known as Martha Kirigo, he is the eighth born child of his parents. Gachagua always tells the public that he is a Mau Mau kid. During the contention his parents were in the Mount Kenya forest. His mother Martha used to take care of the Mau Mau freedom fighters and furnish them with food and ammunition. His father was constructing and servicing firearms for the liberators, Gachagua revealed that during that era he used to adjust the weapons of the Mau Mau fighters. Gachagua began his early childhood education in the year 1971 at Kaberuini Primary School. After completing his primary education in the year 1977 he joined Kenyaga High School for his O and A level. He enrolled at the University of Nairobi in the year 1985. He took a Bachelor of Art degree in Political Science and Literature and he graduated in the year 1988. During his time at the university he served as the leader of Neri District Students Association. He also served as the chairman of the Association of Literature Students. Gachagua did additional studies in advanced public administration course at Kenya School of Government between the year 1999 and 2000. He later on went to paramilitary training at the Administration Police Institute. He was appointed as the Assistant Secretary in the Ministry of Home Affairs and National Heritage during the regime of the late President Daniel Mui. Gachagua was named Personal Assistant in the Head of Civil Service Office in the year 1990. He was appointed as the District Officer Cadet D.O. of Kakamega five years later. He later shifted to Ngarua in Laikipia County in the year 1997. He is also the former district officer of Kiamba. Ten years later Gachagua resigned from the public service job and he ventured into business in the year 2000. He established Rigo Group of Companies. This group of companies mainly has interest in furniture, real estate and general merchandise, Former President Uhuru Kenyatta hand-picked Rigadi Gachagua as his personal assistant. By then Uhuru was the Minister for Local Government. It was in the year 2001 during the last years of Kenya African National Union Kanu administration. In the year 2006 Gachagua fell out with Uhuru Kenyatta and he went to work with his brother by the name of Nderi to Gachagua. At that time Nderitu Gachagua was the governor of Neri County. Gachagua was accused of meddling in the affairs of Neri County by acting as the de facto deputy governor when his brother was away. During the time when his brother Nderitu Gachagua was the governor of Neri County he was absent from his duties. Rigadi Gachagua appeared to be calling the shots in Nari County even though there was a deputy governor by the name of Samuel Wamathai. The constitution stipulated that the deputy governor should act as a governor in case the governor is not around. At that time Deritu Gachagua was absent from his work for a long time because of health reasons, during the parliamentary session some members of the county assembly accused Rigadi Gachagua of taking advantage of Samuel Wamathai's late demeanor. Rigadi Gachagua later on went ahead to deny those claims. Unfortunately Nderitu Gachagua who is the brother of Rigadi Gachagua is now long dead. He died on 24th of February, 2017 at the Royal Marsden Hospital in London in the United Kingdom. Nderitu Gachagua was undergoing treatment after he was diagnosed with pancreatic cancer. When Nderitu Gachagua died he listed his younger brother Rigadi Gachagua as one of the three executors and part beneficiary of his will which was valued at Kenyan shillings 2 billion worth of property in the year 2017. Gachagua's other brother by the name of James Rariani also died on May 8, 2022.
The news of his death left Rigadi Gachagwa shattered and made him say that he now remains alone among the sons of Kirigo. Rigadi Gachagwa rose into the limelight in Kenya in the year 2017. This was after the death of his brother Neritu Gachagwa who was the first governor of Neri County. Gachagwa wanted to replace his late brother as the governor of Neri County. He also wanted to take over the political leadership of the family which his late brother had left behind. Gachagwa vied for the member of parliament of Mathira constituency under the Jubilee party ticket. He had changed his mind about vying for the gubernatorial seat of Neri County and he opted for the MP seat of Mathira constituency. He won the MP seat and he was sworn in as the member of parliament for Mathira constituency. After getting the position Gachagwa became a very close friend of President William Ruto who was the deputy president by then, Gachagwa married a very beautiful woman by the name of Dorcas Wanjiku in the year 1989. Dorcas is a retired banker and she is now a pastor in Mathira. They met at the university event which was attended by the late President Daniel Moi at the University of Nairobi in the year 1985. They are blessed with two sons who are known as Kevin and Keith and they lived together in their multiple million Kenyan shillings mansion in Sagana. Gachagwa has been involved in a lot of controversies before. In the year 2017 he clashed with Kariako Tabiko who was the cabinet secretary for environment and forestry over the destruction of alleged illegal intakes in Mount Kenya region. Gachagwa claimed that many of the intakes destroyed were legal and led to a water crisis for thousands of people. In October 2020 the country's assets and recovery agency which is tasked with securing assets acquired from suspected proceeds of crime. They secured a court order to freeze more than 200 million Kenyan shillings which was held in Gachogo's four bank accounts. During his campaign on August 9, 2022 election he said that he will recover all of his frozen money if Kenya Kwanzaa takes leadership of the country. He will then build a nice house where men can grill meat and drink. Gachagwa was accused of securing multi-billion tenders from Neri County government between the year 2013 up to the year 2017 by using proxies. In the year 2021 July Gachagwa was charged with 7 billion Kenyan shillings money laundering charges. He went ahead to dismiss claims that he had acquired his wealth through dubious means. Gachagwa made it clear that he was a shrewd businessman and he made his fortune through several businesses that he owned. Gachagwa said that he owned a sweet factory which gave him good money. He also organized discos while at the university and he used to get 2,600 Kenyan shillings as a boom. In order for Rigadi Gachagwa to be appointed as William Ruto's running mate on August 9, 2022 general elections, he had to face a stiff competition from other candidates who were interested in becoming the running mates. He triumphed over his competitors who were known as Justin Muturi who was the Speaker of the National Assembly, Ben Waiguru who is the Governor of Kirinyaga County, Alice Wahome who was the member of parliament for Kandara constituency and lastly Kitare Kindiki who was the senator of Meru County. On 15th of May, 2022 Deputy President William Ruto of United Democratic Alliance Party UDA announced that he had picked businessman and Mathira MP Rigadi Gachagwa as his running mate for the August 9, 2022 elections. They won the August election under the Kenya Kwanzaa Coalition Party and Gachagwa is now the deputy president and William Ruto is now the president. Rigadi Gachagwa who has been nicknamed Rigiji by a young lady by the name of Ivy Chelimo is a very wealthy man. He is currently worth 800 million Kenyan shillings. This includes his assets, money and income. Currently his primary source of income is politics. 
As the deputy president of Kenya Rigathi Gachagwa earns a monthly salary of 1,227,188 with a salary market adjustment of Kenyan shillings 190,875. He also receives a house allowance of 300,000 Kenyan shillings with an official vehicle with an engine not surpassing 3,000 cubic centimeters. He also earns an annual medical cover alongside his wife and children. The cover includes inpatient cover worth 10 million Kenyan shillings, outpatient cover worth 300,000 Kenyan shillings. Maternity cover worth 150,000 Kenyan shillings, dental cover worth 75,000 Kenyan shillings and optical cover worth 75,000 Kenyan shillings. Gachagwa earns a monthly pension equal to 80% of his monthly salary. According to the Retirement Benefit Act of 2015 the figure summarized an annual pension of 11.8 million Kenyan shillings. Once Gachagwa will retire he will be supplied with two saloon vehicles whose engine's capacities will not exceed 2,000 cubic centimeters. The vehicle will be replaceable after every four years. He will be awarded with a one four-wheel drive vehicle with an engine capacity not exceeding 3,000 cubic centimeters. Gachagwa will also get 184,500 Kenyan shillings monthly fuel allowance. His family will be entitled to full medical and hospital cover catering for both local and overseas treatment. Other benefits that he will receive are two housekeepers, two drivers, two senior support staff, two cooks, accountant, personal assistant, two gardeners, armed security guards upon request, diplomatic passport, and then maintenance expenses for his vehicles. He will also be granted access to VIP Lounge 2 at the airports within Kenya.